Hey, hey, Blue Table fans. Let's take a look at what's new today. Whoosh. Right. So, uh, first off, we had a D&D game last night. I was just jonesing real hard for some of the creativity that goes along with it. I took this Pathfinder map and created a whole adventure out of it. It was pretty awesome and fun. Uh, let's see here. New for this session were these horses. Horses are a really big deal in my game for overland travel. And I have five characters being played by four people. <clears throat> I got this tree guy, a Goran, Blood Rage Barbarian or something like that. A witch, male, which would make it a warlock. And my, that'd be a really cool figure out of Sisters of Thorn uh, parts that we had extra. We had extra legs, so he basically just repositioned the legs and he made this guy too, which I think I showed already. And this is his familiar, this green scorpion creature. A uh, dark elf assassin and a gunslinger and a mutagen warrior rat folk. And uh, for the Mutagen Warrior, this is just some pick, uh, models I picked up on trade. This is from a game called Confrontation. And these are uh, Griffins of Aquilan, or however you say it. And I used a lesser, this model is a lesser hill giant, a cockatrice, this, um, oh my gosh, how can I not remember what they're called? They're from Sylvaneth. Anyway, uh, a dwarf wizard, uh, but that's not something that's actually in the game just yet. And uh, there you go. So we had a ton of fun, very exciting, and uh, I tried a few new things. Uh, in fact, I'm going to make a video about my DMing advice. Haha, <laughs> everyone's got an opinion. All right, this is a model from Forge World for Adeptus Custodes. It's part of that giant Custodes project. And we did a little further repositioning on this guy to make it look like he was lunging forward. So uh, we've got a pin in his back foot holding him on and then we redid, basically redid the angle of the model. And uh, really it's got, it's just got a good feeling to it. So Pathfinder, I'm still playing Pathfinder first edition. We have not switched over to second edition yet. There's just not enough books published for it. And really, there's, there's a learning curve associated with it. And besides, I have all these first edition books. My players love it. We understand how it all works. And this is where we are right now. But I do believe we are going to switch over to second edition in about six months. So anyway, uh, what else? Oh, I got to do a review for Easy Roller Dice Company, but I'm just going to give them a little plug right now. Uh, I have this dice rolling uh, dice storage thing and I absolutely just love this thing. It's a great format and you can roll the dice in the lid or here and it's just it's nice not to have your dice flying everywhere and I highly recommend this company. They've uh, sent us some really good stuff. I have a giant okay hold on I'm getting by here a giant uh, undead army Legions of Blood Army, and some of these models just turned out really good. I can't wait to show them off. This is just a little bit of a preview, but this army is done. It's got like 180 figures in it, something like that. Uh, also, I managed in the D&D game to get out some of my Deep Madness models. It's a board game with figures, very common now to have figures. And it has about 240 figures in it. And I managed with uh, some new painters uh, about a year and some odd ago, I managed to paint up the entire thing. And so I've got these figures just on hand to uh, use for whatever. Also, some Star Wars Legion. This is a 32 millimeter game. I do believe it's the scale. And I got to tell you, if I were 13, I would have just lost my mind for this game. Just really, really good stuff. All right, before I let you go, I gotta make my plug for the Wholesale Account Program. I'll put the link in the liner notes. 
It's a really great deal. You pay a certain amount up front and you get uh, your services vastly at a vastly lesser amount, basically a wholesale amount. And the credits are transferable as well. So technically you could give away or sell them to other people, thus wholesale account. And what else? Check out the web store. I put up like 30 new lots and um, there you go. Yeah, that is, that is good times. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in and I hope you got your inspiration for the day. Yeah.